welcome to the first episode of my adventures in Riverside. And as I promised, we're beginning with the Baxters, consisting of Don Baxter, his wife Sarah Baxter, and their son Alex. So just as a reminder, Don is the original Don Lothario, and he has been unfaithful to Sarah in the past with their neighbour, Dina. Although he thinks he's just flirting. So despite having been caught cheating with Dina by Sarah's sister Virginia, they still want to save their marriage. Well, at least Sarah is really determined to. Sarah also wants another baby. Maybe she's hoping that will save their marriage. So we'll see how that works out for them. I'm just gonna start by sending Don to work and Alex to school. And then Sarah's getting some alone time today at home. So I did give Sarah a makeover. I've given makeovers to everyone in the neighborhood. Um, Sarah now looks a lot more like someone who works in science. Also, if you see this lagging, it's a huge lot, okay? And I've got a shitty graphics card, so. Oh, look, look who decided to stop by. It's Virginia. Let's go with Virginia, shall we? So Sarah and Virginia are just gonna spend some sister time together right out on the street, as always. She also wants to gain a cooking skill point. Uh, maybe I could get them to go inside and watch the cooking channel. Do they have a TV? They do have a TV, but it's in Alex's room. I think I'm gonna either buy them a TV or just move Alex's TV down here. I kind of feel bad taking that away from Alex, so I think I'm just gonna buy them a new one. They also don't seem to have any bookshelves. What do you guys have? Oh, I have one of these cheap ones. Hmm. I think it will have to be this one. We also have got some visitors. Okay, it's all of the Andersons. All right, let's see what happens. Oh my God, wait, Marty and Virginia? Hmm. Marty and Virginia could hook up, I'm just saying. They're, they're, they're both Roman Sims. Oh, you've turned it off. Do you not like it? You want to gain a cooking skill point. What's wrong with you? She doesn't want to watch TV. Um, I will need to buy some bookshelves anyway. How about this one? Oh, she wanted to buy a bookshelf. That makes sense. Cleaning, cooking, typical family sim. <gasps> okay, I mean, okay, that's not surprising. Well, they just fell in love. Okay, here's also Thomas, Sarah's dad. I think we should greet him. Alex's grades are slipping. Oh no. Let's see, Don is home. He brought some money. He's gonna chat with Marty be asked is he gonna ask her to help with his homework that should be amazing i've never seen that happen autonomously before so no he's asking he's asking her to read him something i think that's nice what's don up to don don wants to chat um as long as he doesn't um want to make out with lisa or anything don and lisa have three balls three Oh my god, that is not going to not happen. <laughs> Alright, that's enough reading. I'm gonna get uh, Sarah to get back to reading cooking books. I'm sorry if I'm being too mundane, but you know I really like doing the mundane things. He's gonna ask Don about the homework, but first he could maybe try and dance to some music? I don't know, maybe he likes music. Oh! He does like music and dance, good to know. I'm gonna have her earn this point and then she can go make some food. And Alex and Dawn are just doing some homework writing in the dining room. All right, one day has passed. We also have a dog ruining our flowers. He wants to earn a skill point, so I think I'm gonna earn him a creativity skill point. Hopefully that will give him some fun. Hear loud noise. Oh, that's rude. <laughs> Your son's piano playing isn't just loud noise, Don. <gasps> oh, oh, what? Okay. Um. <gasps> no. Oh my God. You guys have upset little Alex. Oh no. Alex is really upset to see his dad and his auntie fighting in the living room. Poor little Alex. Oh no. He's raging. Um, well, he still does need fun, so I'm gonna have him go back. Oh, Virginia is also starving. It's okay, Virginia, go home. We're gonna make some food, though. We are. 
We're go we're gonna make um, hamburgers. Also, this room doesn't have light. Sarah wanted to cook, but she was studying the cookbook for so long that all of her guests left because they were starving. Sarah fears breaking up with Dawn. Okay, so they, uh, I mean, Sarah wants a baby and Dawn wants to woohoo. So tonight they're gonna do some woohooing. And I don't know if I should have them try for baby. I think I will. And little Alex is being so good at the piano. I really hate these adults for not appreciating him. He is improving. I think it's gonna be bedtime for little Alex. I can't help calling him that. He's gonna take a bath while the adults are talking. Where are you going, Don? Where are you going? No, don't, don't wash it. I don't like Sims washing dishes. If there is a Sim in the household who can lick them instead, because it takes less time and it fills up some of their hunger. I think Sarah can, yeah. Don't want to invite someone on a date. Maybe I could invite Sarah on a date and then they could end the date with some baby making. I think that's that would be nice. Oh, somebody here stinks. Gina stinks. Let's just say goodbye to everyone. Oh no, Don, you idiot. He woke up Alex by playing with his remote control car. That's just... That's just not it. I know I should have locked Alex's door. I literally knew. I was thinking about it. Okay, don't, don't, don't wash it when you can lick it. Like, be efficient. You guys are exhausting. Has Alex not had his bath? Alright, it's date time, I say. She said no. She's like, forget about it. It's way too late and I hate you anyway. Oh, dear Lord. This marriage is not gonna be saved like this, Sarah. Don was getting ready for a romantic night. Look, Don wants to have two lovers. And he's already in love with Dina. So Don clearly wants to fall in love with Sarah again. And Sarah does not want to break up with Don either. But she just cannot forgive Don yet. I don't think she can. I don't even know if they're gonna be able to sleep in the same bed. I'm gonna try to have them sleep in the same bed, but it might not. It might not happen. Yes, there she goes. Um, then I'm gonna wake Don up and Don is gonna go and sleep on the sofa or something. That's his punishment, you know. Look, all his needs are going down very bad. I do not like to see it, but he deserves it. I have a mod that makes Sims sleep in until 7, 8, 9 or 10 in the morning. But Don has had a rough night and he just couldn't stay asleep on that couch, so... Anyways, Alex is gonna have to take a bath because he looks like he didn't take one last night, so... He needs to be clean for school. Sarah's gonna stay asleep until 10, I think, because she is super lazy. I'm gonna let her sleep, she deserves it. And Don is just gonna get some hamburgers for breakfast. Alex, what are you doing? Why is Alex not taking a bath? Are you kidding me? This bathroom does not have a door. Well, that explains it, doesn't it? All right, that should do it. I'm gonna have Alex come up here and use this bath now anyway because I wanna see if the door works. I have trust issues now about this house, so. He just wants to gain skill points, so cute. I love Alex. Don is, for once, going to clean up after himself because Sarah's still asleep and he just wants to make it up to her by being helpful around the house. Oh look, Don also likes music, of course he does, because he and Alex are the same person. Alex is off to school and I hope he's gonna have some- oh, he's already eating his lunch. His pre-packed lunch on the school bus. I don't know who packed lunch for him. Maybe Don did, he wanted to be useful. Don is off work today and Sarah only has work later, so I thought today maybe they could spend some time together just hanging out maybe watching tv together something like that just for their relationship to build up a little bit because sarah clearly does not like don very much as a person at the moment she needs some fun so she could come and watch some tv and don could just join her nothing better 
than watching TV together. Just bored of it. <laughs> oh, look at her. She does not like doing this. She's like, I'd rather be reading my books alone. All right, well, that didn't help a lot, did it? However, they can now hang out, which is good. That usually helps, I think. I'm just gonna turn the plumber off because I, I don't like to see it. Well, I mean, Don is a record store clerk, so it makes sense that he likes music so much. He actually could get a promotion. Oh no, he couldn't because he needs one more friend. And then I think he could get promoted to level five and they could earn uh, some more money. He could probably not get promoted above level five because he hasn't got a degree, but they're talking about all sorts of interesting things. And look, Sarah doesn't despise him anymore. She's still not sure she's interested in what he has to say though. This isn't too bad. They're already 33 up. Sarah's gonna go off to work in an hour. Alex is doing slightly better at school. He's got a C, I think he should be fine. He can just do his homework right here on the floor. Alex is trying his best to get better at school because he thinks his parents might be happier from that and might stop arguing with each other. Don is happy he finally gets to sleep in Sarah's bed now that Sarah is gone. <laughs> Look, he doesn't want to do anything with, ne with Dina at the moment. I almost said Nina. <laughs> He really just wants Sarah to finally forgive him. Speaking of whom, Sarah has gotten a chance card. Do you think Sarah would tell her boss what she thinks? Well, she is very lazy, so I think I'm gonna let Wiki do it. Oh, she earned a logic skill point. That's great. That's good for you, Sarah. So now I don't know if I should get Don to hook up with another woman because he does want two lovers, but at the same time, he wants to save his marriage too, so... I mean, you know, why not both? He could hook up with someone and Sarah wouldn't have to know. And like, I'm just saying that Lisa and Don have three boards. I'm just saying, okay, let's just start that with a friendly phone call. Alex just got better at playing the piano and he wants to talk about his hobby. I think he should talk about music to his dad. I'm gonna call Lisa back later. <laughs> Is there anybody out here? Oh yes, it's Jennifer Rose. Wait, 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 we need to greet Jennifer Rose. I want to greet Jennifer Rose. Alex gets let down by his dad once again because his dad is going after girls and doesn't want to talk to Alex. I'm sorry, Alex, but Jennifer just looks like the right woman for Don. Or who knows? Jennifer is not a Roman sim, so... Oh, she does like Don, it seems. Just talking, all right then. Well, so is Alex on the internet. When does Sarah come home? She comes home at 10, so I think Don is gonna have to say goodbye to Jennifer before that. Right, I think, oh, you can flirt with her. Mm. I think it's time to say goodbye for now. Sarah's gonna get a promotion. Field researcher, I think she should accept that. I mean, we need the money at least, and she is an audit sim, so I think she would accept that, yeah. Finally, Alex gets to share his thoughts on music with his dad. They just became best friends, that's lovely. <gasps> Wait, they were about to woohoo and I just exed it. Oh no, what have I done? I've been forgetting about this, but it, this means I could have them woohoo through the ACR menu. Let's try will I woohoo. Ah, uh, so they were trying to woohoo, but she was going to reject it. They've got zero attraction score, jeez. Let's give it a try. I don't know if they're gonna do it. Let's see what happens. Oh, wait, who just fell in love? Don just fell in love. They are trying for baby. I did not direct them to try for baby. That's exciting. I love ACR. They are now friends and they have tried for baby, so that's our goal done for today. Oh, that's disgusting. I hope Don gets eaten by flies. Don has to go to work and Sarah is home all day, so Today is probably not going to be the day that Don earns yet another lover. Or oh, who knows, maybe in the evening. Sarah's just planning on spending her whole day studying. And there go the bills. Sarah has learned couples counselling. Now she can see a spark of hope in her marriage to Don. And Alex has a really difficult decision to make at school. Should he join the dance team or the gymnastics team? I'm going to have him join the dance team. Alex brings a friend home. That never works for me. Yes. Okay, that's what I'm talking about. <laughs> oh, is he home? Hello? That was weird. When I said that chance card never works for me, 
I meant like they never really brought a friend home. I didn't think he would reset him so he would be home. That's not good because now he doesn't have homework and that means he cannot get better at school. That sucks. Dawn wants to woohoo and wants to ask someone on a date. I want to send Dawn to a community lot. Where do you go when you want to find a date? Do you go to the mall? Oh, there is a juice bar there. Okay, that sounds great. It does have a hot tub too. I think I'm going to send him to the mall. So here we are at the mall and this looks just vibrant. Dawn wants to be friends with Jennifer, so maybe I can call Jennifer. I'm just going to buy him a cell phone right here. So now he can call Jennifer. I know I sent him out here because I wanted to find him someone new, but um, he wants to be friends with Jennifer, so they're very close to becoming friends now. Yeah, there they go. The light that I used to light my face is dying gradually. It's because it's not plugged in to a socket right now and it's just run running on battery. I think I'm just gonna turn it off now. Nothing exciting is happening back at the Baxter's while Don is away. Sarah is just doing some gardening and Alex, I think, is just playing the piano. He wants to get real good at it. And Don is back home and he meets Sarah right outside the house. <laughs> He's saying hi to her but she doesn't even see him. Sarah is really tired. I don't know if it's because she has studied so much today. She has truly overworked her brain or if it's because she's pregnant. Dawn hasn't got work tomorrow but Sarah does so that means it's finally time for Dawn to bring another lover home. I want to see if Sarah will let Dawn sleep next to her now. Yes, okay, they're, they're even cuddling. Okay, maybe this is going decently. Dawn is in the mood for some dating today. That's good because the time is right for that. I think I'm going to make him call uh, Jennifer. First, I'll just have them talk. Jennifer doesn't have a job yet, so she's free all day. I don't think Sarah got pregnant. If she had gotten pregnant, she would have gotten her first baby born by now. I think they're gonna have to try again tonight. Don is now going to ask Jennifer out on a date. And it looks like she said yes. He also wants to be friends with Lisa now. I guess I'm gonna lock that in as well. There she is. Just a classic Sims 2 date. Nothing to see here. Just pillow fighting on the street, as always. We got bills again? I've just paid the previous ones. I think they just developed crushes on each other. She wants to go to a community law, but I'm too lazy for that right now. Alex just won money. Is that Dina? Dina just came by and they're greeting each other from far away. Okay, I wonder if there will be some drama here. I'll see what happens. I don't want to interfere. Is that Sarah coming home? There will be more drama. Oh <gasps> No, Donnie's just going to kiss Dina right in front of Sarah. Do I let that happen? Can she even get mad at Dawn if they're not in love? I'm guessing that's going to be put to test right now. I don't know if this is going to destroy the marriage or not. I'm very curious. But it looks like Dina's going inside, so um, maybe she will not catch them kissing and that. She's just going to go relax in the hot tub. Okay. He's also going to go relax in the hot tub. Wait, what's happening now? Is this... Okay, I'm confused. Sarah and Don, I think they are gonna do some romance in the hot tub. He's on a date with Jennifer. <laughs> That's ridiculous. Do you think they're gonna try for baby? I want them to try for baby. Jennifer just stood there like, okay, what now? Please do it. Please try for baby. And there's also Dina in the background just walking in the house. Oh, <laughs> look at this shit. That was a great time, says Jennifer. I do think she's stuck. Should I move her out of the way? Because like she seems genuinely stuck. I'm gonna move her in the house. She doesn't seem to care that Don and Sarah were just woohooing behind her back. She is probably aware that Don is married. So I'm gonna have to go and have Don eat because he's gonna starve to death and I don't want that. Sarah's also gonna go eat. Everybody's gonna go eat. Hi, Dina. Sarah doesn't seem bothered 
that Dina and Jennifer are just walking around the house. Yep, something here is um, is not right. Kiss romantically? You know, I'm just gonna let all of this happen, okay? I'm just gonna let it happen. <gasps> She's gonna come in here. Okay, okay, this is happening. Now, Sarah has got a crush on Don. I don't think she's quite in love, but she now likes him a lot more. And he's just going to break her heart once again with the same woman. And it's not ACR, you see? It's just a normal romantic kiss. I'm sorry, Sarah. Oh, maybe it's not happening? Sarah's talking to Dina. They seem to be having a nice chat. That was another close call. Oh, Jennifer likes Alex playing the piano. What are you gonna do? Are you gonna serenade? Oh my god. Can something happen finally? Don, please go and go through with that serenade, please. Sarah, Sarah, why are you not reacting to this? Sarah, Sarah's so done with Don. Oh, there we go. Oh, but it was Dina. It was, okay, what the fuck has just happened? Well, apparently Dina did not like Don kissing. Jennifer. Yeah, Sarah's just off to sleep. She's like, I don't care what you guys are doing. I literally do not care. What a mess. Okay, Dina, I think, yeah, Dina wants to poke Don. I can't believe Dina got jealous. Dina's a Roman sim. But I think they were just such a good match. At least Dina thought they were. Alex, go to sleep. You don't need to see all of this. This was an unexpected turn of events. Apparently, Sarah seems to have forgiven Don. And she did not get offended by Don kissing Jennifer, but Dina did. Dina, for some reason, took offense that Don had another lover and that she wasn't his only one. Well, that's great news for us because there was drama, but there's also a chance for Sarah and Don to make babies. Sarah's just so set on having another baby with Don that she just overlooks these things now. I love this game. They still have zero attraction score, but I'm gonna I'm gonna have them try for baby in the bed. Well, everything seems to be alright again in this household. Alex is off to school and Don needs to take a shower before he's off to work today morning. Yep, there we go. She did get pregnant. <laughs> we will not see the baby though in this in this episode, so that's too bad. This is our last day in this household. She wants to gain a skill point, so I'm gonna have her come study cleaning. Because that's what she needs for her job. And that's also what she needs to clean those dirty toilets. Look, Jennifer was here, and she's just so mad at Dina. Oh, God. Don's boss puts him in charge of choosing a husband for the store. Don has to pick a band. I don't know what's going to happen. I'm gonna pick the llamas. Oh, he earned two charisma skill points? Those are always good for Roman Sim. Sarah is once again spending the whole day studying. And Alex's grades are improving, which is great. Oh, Don could become a party DJ. Should I do it? I'm going to do it. And we've got Uncle Jack here again. I think Jack likes Don. I mean like a friend. Don wants to fall in love with three Sims, but currently he only has one Sim that he's in love with. Um, however, I think I'm gonna try to pursue Lisa now because they have three bolts and that should be easy. God, we need to garden. Tomorrow is Alex's birthday, but we're not gonna stick around for that this time. Right, um, everybody can come eat, actually. There's a family dinner going on here and I think Don feels excluded. I'm gonna have him ask Lisa on a date though. Let's go to a community lot because I don't, I don't want to ruin their marriage now. Let's go to this shop. I've not been there yet. They just get along so well because they're both Roman Sims. They're already on a great date and this date began like five seconds ago. Right, it's makeout time. Well, she wants to woohoo. <gasps> well, they don't get jealous. <laughs> Don and Lisa don't get jealous of each other, so it's fine. And nor does Marty. <laughs> These Roman sims are just... Oh, well, there it is. She's just going back and forth, you know? This is incredible. This is incredible. <laughs> back in the household, it's Friday night, so I'm gonna let 
little Alex play the piano for a bit longer tonight. While Sarah's just gonna go to bed because she's exhausted, I really need to do something about this. This is probably the best I can do. It's a bit ugly, but it will do. What car is this? Hello? This was the carpool for Don. That he missed because he's not at home. Well, I've completely forgotten about the fact that Don could have to go to work today. His performance will go down a little, but um, I can't do anything. He's not at home. Not for another two hours. I'm just gonna let Alex gain this skill point and then uh, he's gonna go to bed as well. And now we're just waiting for Don to get back and face the reality of missing work today. There he is. Yep, everything is perfectly all right in this family. Oh look, they're getting up. Uh, that, you know what that means? They're getting up and that means that Sarah is getting her first baby bump. Yes! So, it's Saturday morning and that means our round is over. And oh my god, I just realized I miscalculated. I was playing for five days. I was only supposed to play four days, but apparently I thought at the beginning Sarah was 32. But now I'm just looking at my sheets and she was 31, meaning I was supposed to play until yesterday morning. Well, we're just gonna play one less day next round, so that's it. So currently, Dawn is 37, Sarah is 36, and Alex is 12. In the next round, Alex is gonna turn into a teenager. Dawn is probably gonna get some more women to fall in love with, and Sarah is gonna be giving birth to the newest addition to the family. Everybody seems happy and content despite the things that have happened. Sarah gave up expecting Don not to flirt with other women. They worked on their relationship and they managed to work it up to a point where they managed to try for baby and get pregnant as well. They have both advanced in their careers as well. Sarah spent so much time studying and it has paid off. She's now a field researcher. Don is now party DJ, which might be good for him, you know. He might meet some new women at those parties. Not that he has a reason to complain because there are already enough women swooning over him in Riverside. And Alex discovered that he was excellent at the piano and he really loved music. And he managed to get his creativity skill up to level 7, which is amazing for a kid. And he even managed to start getting better at school. He always wanted to write his homework. Maybe in the next round, he will manage to get an A-plus report card. I'm gonna lock that in for him. Unfortunately though, Don has lost Dina as a lover because Dina did not enjoy realizing that she was not the only one that Don was cheating on Sarah with. She wanted to be the only other woman. I'm sorry, Dina. Well, that concludes things for this episode. Next time, we're gonna be playing the Thompsons, so we're going to see how Sarah's siblings and father are doing. If they manage to find love, jobs, all of that. If anybody's made it till the end of this, uh, thank you so, so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, feel free to like the video, um, subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you with a new episode of this as soon as I can. It will probably take a week, but we'll see. I try to keep myself to the weekly schedule thing, but it's not easy. So we'll see about it. Um, thank you so much again. Bye-bye. Uh,